Our fifth and final 2016 Ashoku Cordes Innovation Awardee is Watson, founded by a dear friend and colleague out of Boulder, Colorado. Watson is a truly new and unique model for higher education for the next generation of social entrepreneurs age 18 to 23. Through their partnerships with Lynn University and Europa University, they are the first ever credit-bearing incubator, teaching the entrepreneurial skills of creativity, empathy, grit, resilience, and teamwork, among many others. They also provide short master courses taught by leading entrepreneurs, thinkers, and leaders in social entrepreneurship to help the students advance and develop solutions around the world's toughest problems. Accepting this award on behalf of Watson University is its founder and Ashoka Fellow, Eric Glustrom. All right, so uh, good morning. Um, thank you so much to the Cordes Foundation and to Ashoka U for bringing together such an incredible group of people. It's really a privilege to be a part of this and to be honored with the award this morning. And I wanted to start out with a story that hopefully resonates with some of y'all. Take you back to my junior year in college. It was about 1 a.m. And at this point in my academic career, I had mastered that fine skill known as procrastination. So I was studying for a biochemistry exam we had the very next morning. But I had to step out of the basement of the library where I was studying to make a phone call in the stairwell. I was calling Western Union. And over the course of the next hour, up until about 2 AM, I did my level best to convince this Western Union customer service agent to take me off their blacklist. They had put me on the blacklist because they thought I was making too many fraudulent criminal transfers to this refugee community over in Uganda. Not only did I successfully convince Western Union that I was indeed not making fraudulent transfers, but rather sending a group of students in this refugee community to go to school, but educate the organization that I had started a few years earlier would later become my life's work. And I reflected back on this experience in the stairwell many years later, and I wondered why is it that, you know, the work that was going to become uh, my work after college, also what I learned the most from during college, what made the most impact, and I guarantee you what Amherst is more proud of than my obvious lack of a career in biochemistry, why is it that my office space, so to speak, was the stairwell, my working hours were from midnight till 2 a.m., and specifically, why is it that so many next generation social entrepreneurs find themselves alone in this metaphorical staircase trying to prove to the world that they are actually not frauds or criminals, they're just social entrepreneurs? So many years later, 2012, 2013 came along, and I had the opportunity um, to move to the Board of Educate and actually get Watson started to address some of these issues. Watson is a new university model in Boulder, Colorado, based in beautiful Chautauqua Park, pictured here for next generation social entrepreneurs. Watson really functions like a degree-bearing incubator. Students can come to Watson for either a semester program or a full degree track, and for incubating their ideas, actually earn their degree through two partnerships we've created with Lynn University and Naropa University. The Watson experience consists of about 70 mentors and master course teachers, including the co-recipient of a Nobel Peace Prize, one of Time Magazine's Hero of the Planet, and many others. Two years of training and 20 students who we select from over 200 applications each year, and many of those applicants come from a network of over 100 nominators, many of whom are in the room today. The two-year degree track mapped out looks like this. Transformative entrepreneurship focuses on some of the hard skills and methodologies involved in creating a successful social venture, everything from rapid prototyping to financials. The leap of faith, the virtuous entrepreneur, helps students develop the inner clarity, the inner strength, resilience, and grit that they need to be successful. And the Watson Lab is a co-working-like environment in which students work side by side with their peers on developing the ventures. And we bring in hard skills workshops on things like legal issues involved in a startup all the way to time management. Simultaneously to this, students are receiving weekly coaching and mentorship to work through the challenges that they inevitably will face along the way. 
And if students are on the degree track, then they take a series of core classes simultaneously. And these core classes account for about half the degree, and the Watson experience pictured here accounts for the other half of the degree. In effect, that incubator model serves as the student's major. We asked the scholars from the fall 2015 semester to review the experience. Um, when asked to rank the overall value of the Watson experience, they responded with an average of 9 out of 10. However, when asked if they would be likely to recommend Watson to a peer or friend in the right stage to attend Watson, they responded with an average of 9.9 .9 out of 10. So we've been running for about three years. Uh, we have 55 alumni from our semester program who come from 23 countries. You all just met one of the alumni, Ryan Singh, which is up on stage, and many of you had the chance to meet another alumni, Melissa Diamond, who gave a great workshop yesterday afternoon. We did a short survey of the alumni, and we found they've already raised over $10 million for the ventures that they founded or co-founded, and they've hired 108 team members, creating that many jobs. So I'd like to end with a story, and this story comes from one of our master course teachers and a dear friend, Teju Revilochin, um, and it's a story of a man and a son who are walking through the woods. And the son comes across a log and turns to his dad and says, Dad, do you think I could pick up that log? And the dad looks at the log, looks at his son, and says, Son, I know you can pick up that log, but only if you use all your strength. So excited by the challenge, the son rolls up his sleeve, bends over, and does his level best to pick up the log. Unfortunately, it doesn't budge an inch. And he falls back disheartened, discouraged, and looks at his dad and says, Dad, why did you lie to me? And his dad says, son, I know you can pick up the log, but you didn't actually use all your strength because you never asked for my help. So of all the things that Watson does, I think the most powerful is the community that we provide. This is a community that protects the courage of the scholars that we're working with and is also a community that truly allows them to use all their strength. So with that said, um, if your institutions are interested in, in incorporating this degree-bearing incubator model into your current offerings, I would love to talk more. Also, our applications for Watson's fall semester and degree track just opened up, so if you know of any strong candidates, please feel free to nominate them at this easy link. Thank you so much.